Hello guys, welcome to my channel. It's been a while from my last video, but like you know probably from my Instagram or TikTok, I moved back to Bulgaria, so it took me a while to set up everything. However, let's see the topic for today. It is key for success to not play competitive before any warm-up. So, lots of people are using a different softwares like Kovax or MLAP, but I love warming up in Valorant. So here is my way how I'm doing that. I'm starting with the Ghost. It's an amazing pistol though. On medium mode, my target is to hit over 25 kills. Definitely it's not that easy in the beginning, but 1-2 minutes, I'm able to achieve that. Once I'm ready with the medium mode, I'm going straight away to hard settings. I'm trying to get with the Ghost at least a 15 kills. This is a key moment if you want to be better in the first round every map. Practicing with the pistols is giving you a bit more confidence. And believe me, in a week or two, you will see a big difference in your skills. And definitely, if you like the Sheriff, that's a great way how you can improve your game with that pistol. For example, in this practice mode, I learned how to use a classic from close distance or even further. I had a really big trouble to learn how to shoot with that gun, this mode help me to achieve that. Once you feel you're ready with the pistols, definitely you need to continue with the other weapons. My next one is the Vandal. Again, like the pistol round, I'm starting with the medium mode. But this time, my target is not only 25 kills. I'm trying to get at least 28 on the medium mode. I'm choosing the Vandal for the next weapon just because it's a bit slower than the Phantom. So definitely after the pistol, I'm bringing up a bit more speed, but not too much. It's easier for me to shoot with a Vandal after the Ghost. Once I achieve these 28 kills with the Vandal on the medium mode, I'm going to the next setting, which is hard again. And there, I'm trying to hit at least 20 kills. It is really hard though, so sometimes it takes like 5, 6, even more than 10 minutes to achieve that. But this is the key if you want to gain some new skills and if you want to gain some reflexes. Practicing in this way every time before competitive match, soon you will get so much better and the time for warming up is not gonna be that long. So when I started warming up this way, it was taking me probably 20, 25 minutes and now for like 10 minutes I'm ready to go. All depends where you wanna go, what you wanna achieve, what rank you wanna be. Once you achieve with a Vandal your target, for example my one was 20 kills, my next weapon is the Phantom. The Phantom is faster than the Vandal and it's one of the main guns in the game. So I'm not ignoring that and I'm always going to the practice mode with the Phantom 2 on the end. Why I'm choosing the Phantom in the end? Because it's the fastest one. After the Ghost and after the Vandal, I already warm up my hands a bit. But with the Phantom, I can start moving them a bit faster now. Like you probably noticed, every time after medium settings, I'm going to the hard settings too. I'm doing that with the Phantom every time for sure. Why this is so important? Sometimes in the game, the enemy shows up from nowhere, not expected. Practicing this fast shooting will help you to start getting a bit more kills in the matches. You will achieve much better accuracy in your shooting. So definitely guys, don't ignore that. I know in the beginning it's gonna be really hard, but you shouldn't give up. Just keep trying until you get better. There is one more thing after all this practicing. And this is the deathmatch mode. The deathmatch mode, probably most of you have been watching my last video, it's really important for you to improve your skills. Basically, on this mode, you can keep dying as much as you want, you can keep killing as much as you can, and definitely, you're able to finish your warming up on a really great way. Absolutely ready for the real competitive game. 
with this last tip about the death match and how useful can be, my video is coming to the end. Of course, if you want, you are more than welcome to watch this death match game till the end. It's a victory for me. I hope you're not surprised about that. Thank you so much guys for being here and thank you for these people which are gonna stay till the end and watch the full video. Don't forget guys before your next competitive match to warm up. And don't forget, you can do that in Valorant. Have a great day and go to smash some heads.